All right, y'all, welcome back to Mastering Mayhem. The Cat or Caterpillar brand, they just uh, came out with their own cordless power tools, 18 volt power tools, and I'm on their website right now. Just wanted to go through them and show you guys what they're all about. Okay, so here you can see uh, One For All is their, their advertising slogan. You can see we got quite a few tools. It's showing that these uh, three different batteries can uh, provide power for all these power tools here. We got a drill driver, a SDS hammer driver, a sander, a planer, a, what, what do we got there, an angle grinder, a multi-tool. We got, a, it looks like they got an LED light. They have a battery powered radio, circular saw, jigsaw, hammer drill, and impact driver. So all these tools here take these three different batteries. You got the two amperage hour battery, you got the four amperage hour, and then the five amperage hour battery is supposed to be something pretty amazing. And it looks like uh, Cat is attempting this first. So we'll look more into that uh, five amperage hour battery, graphene battery. Uh, they're promising a lot of things in that. So if we just want to go down here, it's showing all tools. 18 volt keeps you moving or keep you moving. Innovations that are trade focused. So just a few things here. It's just showing you a few things about their hammer drill. 80 newton meters max torque. Again, I don't know the all the different types of power uh, supplied through all these different brands, but this is what they're offering here and their brushless motors. It's 10 times longer motor life, 25% more power, and 50% run time. Here's the new graphene battery. It's revolutionary according to them. Uh, I just wanted to get it just to try it and see if it can deliver. It's the first, world's first graphene battery on power tools. The world's first, that's a, that's a pretty nice claim. Hopefully uh, everything works out well for them and they have uh, good uh, outcomes and, and good reviews on this uh, new graphene battery, battery for their power tools. Uh, it's a five amperage hour. It's a compact. It actually looks smaller or the same size as the four amperage hour one, which has the lithium ion. So it's five amperage hour capacity. It can get a full charge in 20 minutes with the ultra fast charger provided by CAT. It can go down to uh, negative 25 Celsius as far as temperature to perform in that type of environment, which is pretty amazing. It's saying four times longer life than a lithium ion battery, which I don't even want to know what the price of that is then. and it stays cooler. It says graphene's low resistance keeps cells cooler under heavy load. So I'm going to try to find out how to get uh, a hold of these, uh, you know, power tools and get that graphene battery if it's not uh, way out of my budget. This is a big thing. The world's first graphene battery on power tools is pretty amazing. The DX13 hammer drill. 80 newton meters of max torque. Here's the new tools that uh, they have out. You got impact drivers. Combo kits, saw, batteries and chargers, rotary hammer, impact wrenches, circular saw, angle grinder, and outdoor power. So I'm just looking at the cordless battery powered tools here. Not really concerned about the corded ones, but you got a few new hammer drills that came out. You got your 65 newton meter drill driver, 65 newton meter hammer drill, 80 newton meter hammer drill, and then a two on one combo kit. So if you click on it, there's as far as I know, there's no prices uh, available at this time. I'm not I'm not too familiar with uh, Cat because I'm just learning about them. I mean, I'm, I've seen them in you know out there in the construction sites, working on the roads and whatnot. For the DX12, which is a drill driver, we got a brushless motor, high torque of 65 newton meters, two-speed gearbox, rubber overmold grip, single sleeve metal chuck, variable speed with the reverse, and auto spindle lock and an LED light. The DX71, which is the impact driver. So three speed design, variable speed with reverse, rubber over mold grip, LED light with pre-light function for work area, and it comes with a belt clip so you can uh, keep it on your belt. So that looks like a nice set. They look very durable, very rugged. So now let's go see what they got uh, for hammers. Okay, so I'm, I'm just more interested in this one here, the SDS rotary hammer. That's battery powered. Um, it looks like it's very capable. And I intend to do a comparison uh, in the future where I do a battery powered SDS uh, rotary hammer uh, compared to a one that you plug in. The DX21, the 18 volt SDS rotary hammer, 
It features a brushless motor as well, electronic overload protection, four function, which is drill, hammer drill, bit rotation, and chisel. And of course, it has the SDS Plus uh, quick change system, forward and reverse rotation, variable speed with reverse, anti-vibration design, electronic impulse function for easily for easily drilling on ceramic tile and LED light. So. This is a very nice looking SDS rotary hammer. So glad they have that as part of their lineup. And then they have the grinders here. Again, I'm just looking at the battery powered one, the DX31B a br brushless motor. It's all right here. So here you can see the different items that came out. You got new drills, new hammers, new grinders, uh, fastening or impact drivers. You have cutting tools, sanding, material removal lights the led light looks pretty powerful and then you have radios and the new batteries and chargers and some accessories so let's go ahead and go through a few of these so for the drills we have a drill driver a hammer drill an 80 newton meter hammer drill so a little bit more powerful there and a two-in-one combo with a uh, drill driver and an impact driver and then it looks like you have two 12 volt uh, drivers. One's a drill driver and they have a 12 volt impact driver. So that's the, the all the battery operated uh, drills that they have. So let's go back to hammers now and see what they came out in the battery powered. Again, the 18 volt 2.2J SDS rotary hammer is what they came out with battery power. So just one new rotary hammer versus all their electric ones. And in the grinders, we have a uh, angle grinder here, the DX31B. All right, let's go into the fastening or the impact drivers. Looks like it's just one. The speed impact driver DX71 is the one that came out with. Let's see what kind of cutting tools they have. Looks like they have a few circular saws. So we got the battery powered 18 volt circular saw there. And then we also have a reciprocating saw, an oscillating multi-tool, an 18 volt planer. And so let's go to the second page here on this. We have an 18 volt jigsaw right there. Let's go to sanding. See what they have in their sanding and battery powered. So they have an 18 volt orbital rotary uh, sander right here. And everything else is electric. So let's go back. Um, if you go to the lights here, looks like they have an LED light. Let's see what kind of lumens it has there. Definitely looks like a nice uh, powerful shop light. 360 directional uh, several directions rubber over mold grip tripod mountable with a variety of other hanging methods as well rubber stand for secure, secure position and gentle use on delicate surfaces so looks like you got a rubber hand stand there and i do believe the specs on this one is 750 lumens as well as 1650 that's what i remember seeing a little earlier and then we have radios it looks like they made a radio battery powered radio bluetooth Looks very durable, able to withstand some, some tough job sites there, but it's a tough and impact resistant. Auxiliary input, USB power output for charging mobile phones. Bluetooth input, soft antenna, carry handle for easy transportation, a digital audio broadcasting, LCD display quality, and FM and DAB. It looks like an auto-tune function in five stations memory. Nice black and yellow. Looks very durable. Always good to have some music on the job site when you're working. It looks like here it's going to show us the batteries and chargers that it's coming with. So you got the two amperage hour batteries. You got the four amperage hour battery. And these two are lithium ion. But then you come over here to the GX5. It looks even smaller than the four amperage hour battery. But it's a five amperage graph graphene battery. 18 volt graphene and then you have these two uh, chargers here um, the 15 amperage one is I guess for the graphene battery let's see if we can find a little more information on that battery okay so that's those are all the new uh, items you can see here drills hammers grinders fasteners or impact drivers cutting tools sanding tools the material remover is only um, electric power not battery powered but the lights the radio and these batteries here and again that that graphene battery is really really exciting to see once it does come out so once again this is their new one for all platform here and a variety of tools and i appreciate you all watching mastering mayhem i hope we uh you know you're as excited about that graphene battery as i am uh, i'm just curious to see what it's going to cost when it comes out first world's first 
graphene battery on power tools. I can't wait to see uh, in person how this thing does. Or if any of you guys uh, get it, your hands on it first, please send me a message, send me a link to your video and I'll share it. But uh, very excited about that. Thanks for watching Mastering Mayhem. Please like, please subscribe, share, comment, click that notification bell and I'll continue to make these videos and I'll see you guys next time.